Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about factoring trinomials when a is greater than 1. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, 4n squared minus 15n minus 25, and we want to factor this completely. Well, let's look at 4 right here, the a value. Well, that lets us know that our form can either be 2n times 2n, because 2n times 2n gives us 4n squared, or we can have this as 4n times a 1n, okay? So we're going to keep these two base forms in our mind as we move forward. Let's look at negative 25, the c value. What two numbers multiply to be negative 25? Well, that's going to be a negative 1 and a positive 25, or a positive 1 and a negative 25. Also, we have negative 5 and positive 5, or if we're going to write it all out here, 5 and negative 5. So now, with that information, we have look at our b value. And we're thinking, okay, which one here, 2n or 4n, times one of these numbers, plus its corresponding 2n or 1n, times the other number, gets us negative 15. All right. And I'm trying to make my first guess as close as possible to negative 15. And I kind of get there by either 4n or 2n, but I'm thinking 4n times a negative 5 gives me negative 20. Minus, or plus a positive 5 gets me negative 15. And so with practice, that's kind of our goal here. You, with practice, you can guesstimate which one's uh, the best choice. So 4n times a negative 5 is a negative 20n. And then if we put a positive 5 right here, 5 times n is 5n. So negative 20 plus 5n gets us a negative 15n. And there we have our final answer. 4n plus 5 times n minus 5. If this video was helpful for you, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, Thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math. When you need help, you use minute math. Minute math, minute math. When you need help, you use minute math. Minutematutor.com.